Finally, it's the Athletic Championship. Hurry up, I want a seat in the front row. Calm down, first thing to come up is sprint. Who do you think will win? Katie, probably. No way, she really is fast, but Amanda is so much better. Fair enough, shall we bet? Mm, okay, I have got a bag full of sweets. You get it if you're right. Okay. But what about Sabrina? She's also taking part in this competition. As if. My little sister is faster than her. Excuse me, may I pass through? You wish. What do you want? Hey, you're Mr. Smith's daughter. Mr. Smith, the man who trains the referees. That's right. He does train referees. He has told me a lot about you, Sarah Muller. What? If you don't want the whole world to know about your passing the referee's exam on your third time, you better let me win. Why should I do that? If the sport director finds out, you are in a big trouble. She only takes the best referees for her competitions. You know that. But just a quick reminder, you will lose your job if you don't let me win. Okay, but don't tell anyone. Don't worry. The competition is about to start any minute. Good luck to both of you. Thanks, good luck to you too. Well, the two of you will need it the most. I'm the best, so I will win and you will lose. Don't get your hopes up too high. Well, we will see who wins. Yeah, right. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the fifth Athletics Championship. Our first competition is sprint. Participating in the one are Katie Cook with starting number one followed by Amanda Clinton and with starting number three, Sabrina Smith. May the best win. Ready, set, go. go, go, go. This is getting really exciting. Hopefully I'll get back with sweet. It was my money after all. Bad luck, I think Katie won. How do you want to know? I'm a girl. Girls are always right. Well, perhaps something strange is going to happen. Sabrina Smith, 4.8 seconds. Katie Cook, 5.1 seconds. And Amanda Clinton, 4.9 seconds. Oh, I think the results are in. And the winner is Sabrina Smith. What the? How is that possible? Excuse me, could you help me please? Sure, what can I do for you? I'm pretty certain that I want the competition, not Sabrina. We thought so too. We see what we can do for you. Thanks, is there anything I can help you with? Yes, of course, if you want to. What can we do? Let's look. Come on, let's follow her. Hurry up! Ah, okay, okay. Oh, what's that? It's a stopwatch. It says Miller on it. Isn't it the name of the referee? Look. It's the times of the competition. The stopwatch was definitely not used for any other competition than the sprint. We better go somewhere private before anyone can hear us. You're right, okay. Are you sure about this? Yes, absolutely. I have the starting number one and this stopwatch is proof that I'm the real winner. My time is best, Amanda second and Sabrina runs lowest. But the referee isn't stupid. She wouldn't confuse the times by accident. No, she's not stupid, so she must have done it on purpose. Okay, we better go to the sports director and tell her about it. You're right. Do you have any idea how long she will be around? Mm, until the end of the competition, I guess. If we hurry, we'll catch her before she leaves. Okay, come on. Come in. Hello. 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 Hi. What can I do for you? We have serious doubts about the competition results. Is that so? Well, where do the starts come from? 
We found Miss Miller's stopwatch. It shows the contestant times. Look. According to the starting number, Katie Cook was fastest in the race. She had starting number one. You're right. I have Sarah Miller and Sabrina Smith brought to my office. That's okay. a good idea. Sarah? Yes, please. We would like to talk about the results of the competition. How come the time on the stopwatch is different to the one the referee has written down? Sarah, explain yourself. Okay, I admit it. I don't want to lie. I switched the times to make Sabrina win. But I didn't want to do it. She made me do it. Shut up! Sabrina threatened at me to tell you that I have failed the referee's exam twice. That's not bad. In the end you passed it. But with great difficulty. I thought you would not have me as referee in your competitions because I wasn't good enough. No, you will stay. But remember, a good referee should never be bribable. Yes. As punishment, you will join the cleaning team. Now to you. You have broken all the rules of fairness. You are disqualified. Katie gets the trophy. But I... Show them that you can be a good loser, Sabrina. For once, be fair. And Katie, congratulations to your victory. You were the fastest and deserve the trophy. Thanks, it's really kind of you. And thanks to both of you too. You did a really great job solving the case. Never mind, it was our pleasure. <laughs> exactly. Well done. <sighs> well, we did it. And you, you owe me a bag of sweets. All right, okay, case is won. Hopefully Sabrina will change for the better. Yeah, hopefully. It's not all about winning. I can't believe you said that. You, of all people, you who won my back of sweets in a belt. I told you, I'm always right. <laughs>